no doxing here. So, as might be obvious, I have a box. And as it says on the box, it has to do with music, or at least noise. <laughs> You don't even want to know how long I have been waiting for this fucking box to arrive. Okay, and it wasn't even that it was taken to ship long. It shipped in literally less than a day. But one of the pieces in here was sold out, not in stock, not restocked for four months. And they said at first, you have to wait two weeks. And I was like, two weeks? Oh my god, fine. I'll wait two weeks, sure. Why not? I'm not in a hurry. When I said I wasn't in a hurry, I did not mean four fucking months. <laughs> Hello? Anyway, it's here now. And it doesn't make me less excited of what's in the box. Just a little bit salty about it, you know? How to open this box is my first question. Because I honestly have no clue. I found my solution. Okay. Oh, no. I'm thinking that this is the way to open it. If it's not, I'm sorry for you guys cringing at me right now. So finally, after four months of waiting, I present to you the contains of the box, but you still can't see it. Okay. <laughs> ah, there it is. You can see the first thing, which is also the thing I had to wait for for this long, and it's the Go XLR. This? beauty will not only act as my mixer but also will act as my preamp which is really nice because that meant that i did not have to buy a separate piece of equipment for that okay so that's exciting let me just carefully put that down and then the next thing is my other beauty a uh, sure mic for the people who don't know these are one of the holy grails of the streamer community and youtube community in a whole for like for the mid-range microphones they're not that expensive but they're definitely more expensive than the samsung meteor mic that i'm using now and have been using for the past four years i think so let me put that down i also got this i got a little ukulele this is not necessarily part of the unboxing as in the microphone setup because this is just something that i saw in the shop and I've been wanting a ukulele because I think they are so cute and I couldn't not buy it. It matches with my hair, I have to redo my hair. That's very cute. Basically, if I have my hair just dyed, it's almost the same color as the lightest green on this. So I'm very excited for that, it's very cute. And then I have this, which are basically the cables of the microphone. Now that we got everything out of the box, I'm going to start with the individual like unpacking of the pieces. Which I hope sincerely that I have enough space on my desk to put the Go XLR because I don't know if I do. I'm gonna start with the one that I unpacked first, which is the Go XLR. Let me just grab my fucking scissors. Bada boom, bada bing. Okay, one thing that I am very happy about is that this one does come with fucking cables. I was so scared that I was gonna have this and then not have the cables and then have to order the cables, you know? Mmm, no. <laughs> Ooh, scary, 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 scary. Expensive stuff. Okay, I got it. There's another pack of cables. I don't know. Ooh, it smells new. This is the Gold XLR. I was scared that it was gonna be smaller than I thought, but it is basically the same size or a little bit smaller than I thought it would be, which is great. I am actually going to use the quick start guide because eh, I don't work with expensive stuff that much. Neither do I with start guides, but I feel like this will be better mixed than with no start guides. Oh God, oh, oh, I thought it was like a booklet, but it's okay i have a little diagram where it says what has to be connected to what so that should be good let me just cable it real quick and see what's next okay 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 so while trying to power the, the go xlr i accidentally pulled out the power source of my computer that was a bit of a hassle but the Go XLR is on right now. I will record on my other thing what that looks like. I wish I could turn it off and back on again because it does do a little swoosh swoosh, which scared the living shit out of me. But it was pretty cool. 
So now that we have that all plugged in, I do want to go to the website of GoXLR to download the software because I have not done that. I'm nicely prepared. Okay, so I just went to the TC Helicon website and this is basically what you get when you search GoXLR software. And I'm just gonna see if I can get it. Here it is. That wasn't too hard to find. Finish. Woo, I did another thing. <laughs> that scared me. Okay. One of the things that I really liked about the GoXLR is how customizable it is, especially with the colors, because I love colors and everything of my setup is black and purple. So, you know, <laughs> it fits well. And I like that I can like adjust it to look like that. It is basically throwing me right into a mic setup page. And before I want to mess with that, I'm going to unpack the microphone next. The thing is, these softwares don't really take into consideration that I am getting both a new microphone and a new GoXLR. So they're like, bitch, where is your microphone? And grab uh, this beauty. It's the Shure SM7B. It's a legendary focal microphone and I am very excited. Some of my streamer friends who are like a little bit bigger than I am or have been in the game for a little bit longer or just have a little bit more money to spend already have this microphone and they sound so so good. So I'm very excited to be that person now because I am going to be that person. Ah. Once again, my beautiful unpacking skills. I think I just, okay, I am going to save the original packaging because I think that's nice. Well, this is for once not damaged. Every time I buy something expensive for like my setup, somehow the package just gets damaged and I'm just like, okay, let's open this beauty up. Oh, safety precautions. Oh, God. <gasps> I got a sticker. I'm going to use my sticker. Definitely. Yes. There's a lot of papers, including a safety precaution. <laughs> the safety precaution is rather big and long. Um, warning. Ignore the warning may cause severe injury or death as a result of incorrect operation. How could you die from a microphone? I sure got my attention with that. And I have a little... Ooh, there it is. This, ladies and gentlemen, is the microphone. I am more than excited for this. The only issue that I have right now is that I'm using my mic currently, so I cannot really attach this one yet. But there's also... <laughs> I didn't know this would come with... Ah! I should be more careful. Okay, I don't know what these all do, but I'm just gonna put these here because they seem important. I didn't know this would come with. So I have this thing now, which is also nice. I don't know if I'm gonna put it on. I'm gonna see if I need it. And if not, I'm not gonna use it. Once again, user guide. I will read. Give me a minute. Okay, um, I'm a bit fucked because as most of you guys know, I am not a native English speaker and these words, I don't know if it's because I'm not a native English speaker or if it's because I don't know much about microphones. I did do my research, obviously. These are a lot of words. Oh, there is the pictures. Okay. Wait, but I don't want to like, uh -huh. but I just want it on the fucking, on my thing. I don't want it like that. Hold on. Well, that's kind of upsetting. Let me try to figure this out. This is not tightening and I don't know if it's supposed to tighten, but it's not. Okay, what I am going to do is I'm going to disconnect my microphone that I'm using right now. So we're going to go down in microphone quality before we go up in it, okay? Okay, I got it to work again. As you can see, my eggplant has gone down because my microphone stand doesn't take this. Now let me try to unscrew this one. This might be doing the trick. This is most definitely doing the trick, guys. It is not exactly how you're supposed to have it. Fuck it, this works. Okay, great. Um, next step will be this, which is to actually like plug it, plug it in. I hope that I bought the right cables. I Googled what kind of cables a different person had uh, that I saw use this microphone. And then I bought something that was similar to it, but just a shorter cable because I don't need that long of a cable this is where i need to be careful okay so this is basically the magic moment where i see if it works or not i don't know how to fix but what i'm thinking right now is that it's this that has to be set up first so it's a dynamic thing and i don't understand why it's not reading it okay so it doesn't like say anything i'm pretty sure it's supposed to work right now for some reason it didn't work in a 
second gain hello now it's working this is how my voice is normally this is how i normally tell that's the thing i don't know how far i i'm just gonna go with this hello can you guys hear me it should be working let me let me let me listen to this audio back this is what the the microphone sounds like right as you plug it in and also right as i plugged it in the xlr i have not seen anything yet so check what it sounds like okay so that was a little bit of an issue this is about how i talk when i stream so i'm just gonna talk like this that's the end of the video i'm sorry if that's a little bit repetitive because that is a little bit more higher up than what i was talking like earlier um but i was noticing that it wasn't picking up my voice like at all so let me see if that works now okay still nothing so i'm going to try to talk right into the microphone to see if that makes any difference because it's seeming like there is a big issue with either the microphone or the cable it is not picking up everything that i'm saying okay so i put down the threshold of the gate seeing if that helped it a bit and seeing if i am still cutting out with that so this is another test okay so that should do it so it wasn't an issue with the microphone thank fucking god i messed a little bit with the settings right now so let me just see if this setters it maybe i don't know <laughs> i'm just gonna compare it and see if it actually did something okay so it's a while later i talked to a friend of mine named dark sword dark sword thank you so much for helping me with setting up my microphone is it fixed now i don't know the thing is i can't hear myself when i'm speaking so i just record this and then watch it back so let me check that okay so it is better now however i do want the stuff to be a little bit deeper if that would make sense let me see if this changes anything okay so it didn't necessarily change much i guess that's just my voice that is like a little bit higher than i want it to be however it does sound a lot better than the old microphone you can literally for the people who like i don't know because obviously the microphone quality kind of changes before like i change the settings so you know just for the fucks of it scroll back to the video like at the beginning or like a little bit earlier than this when i had the microphone that i used to use and just compare it to this right now it's actually crazy i just um went from one of the latest videos to the older video and it's actually fucking crazy how much difference that makes especially when the the microphone was just standing here this is my old microphone by the way i love this microphone this is a holy grail for if you are a starting streamer it's the samsung meteor mic i will put a link to both microphones and the go xlr in my description so you guys can check it out there but yeah it is a big difference and i do like the sound that it gives i am going to tweak a little bit of the settings but i'm probably going to do that over a while so you guys can probably notice in the next couple of videos or the next streams that my voice might like change or this my microphone will kind of change over time because i will be tweaking it and seeing what i like better um because there's a lot to change let me just show you you have the setup here right i have to change the colors i'm going to make them pink and purple uh, you have the gate stuff you have the mic setup which right now it's supposed to i called with a friend and he said it's better to have it good and loud rather than in good only to low so i now have it in this because basically the threshold in the compressor fixes the issue of when it speaks too loud but this is the section that i've been basically messing with a little bit i'm so sorry for the stream stuff um also don't mind the total sub thingies for my twitch um basically these are the settings you want to do at least for my voice if you want the settings to be a little bit like this and then you can use th this you can compare it to what it used to be when i first like used the microphone it is a good idea to have the gain like up 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 there i have it on 68 i would change it to 69 but it does make a lot of difference to one decibel so i don't really want to do that even for the memes even for the memes i don't want to do that so these are the settings that i'm using right now gain 68 which is really necessary because my voice just doesn't pick up all the videos that i saw people had the mic set up like in 60 or around 60 the threshold was a lot higher most man voices 
I always saw videos of men explaining what their settings are, not of women. I don't know if that's a women voice thing or a my voice specific thing, but the threshold did have to go down by a lot for me to even pick up my voice. So these are my settings. You can take these over if you want to. I am personally going to tweak them a little bit, but these settings are fine as is. We have mixer. I have to like do stuff like this still because you have a whole thing of how loud you want your mic to be i can put it up like this and then it's louder and i can put it down like it was earlier and i can do that with chat music game console line in line out system sample and bleep the bleep is a button that you can have right here i don't know if you can hear that but it cuts out my voice and it just does a bleepy thing for example if you say you know um, it's basically for swearing. It's funny. I don't know. You can have voice effects, but I'm not going to do that in this video right now. You can have samples, which is like basically either presets that you want to put in or little clips of music. Yeah, I have like stuff like this on my stream deck right now, like little clips, little sounds, little sound effects that I want to use. And I can use this in these now. Then the FX, I don't know if it's set to anything now. So this is what that sounds like. Then you have lighting because you can change this as i said i'm going to change it to pink and purple and maybe some blues in there as well because that's what my regular setup looks like totally not connected to that flag that's next to me <laughs> and then you have routing which is basically what inputs and outputs happen when for example you can have different sounds for example that i can hear stuff that the stream for example doesn't hear or i can hear something that discord doesn't hear or vice versa the f system is just a little overview of everything that you can do um it's a little update tutorial stuff like that i will be messing more with all the settings but this is what i'm gonna do for now and this is what i'm gonna show for this video so anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video i am very excited about the new microphone i feel like it sounds amazing it sounds exactly how i expected it to be so that's really good because if i didn't expect it to be good i wouldn't have bought it you know <laughs> yeah, i have been enjoying educating myself on audio stuff such as the microphone and the go xlr because i have put up a lot of information that i did not have before me doing this research and i will also put in the description some videos that helped me figure out which microphone that i want because i was also thinking of the rode nz1 which is more famous in the rap community but i ended up going with this one because it has this nice like podcast slash radio sound you know which is really nice to listen to especially when you're listening to like a longer streams it is definitely an upgrade from my old Zenni microphone. I will still be using this one because this one is a lot more portable than this one is. So if I'm going to stream somewhere else for a little bit, I'm going to take this one and not take the whole setup that I have here because this one can stand anywhere basically and this one has to have the arm with it. So there's a lot of reasons where I will still be using this one. So you will still be hearing me from this microphone as well, at least on Twitch, but I will mainly obviously use this one. Anyway, guys, I do want to thank you guys all for watching. I really appreciate it if you have any questions you can ask them in the comment section below because i will do my best to answer every single comment that i get and i'm not a professional but i did put a lot of effort in it and somebody directly responding to you sometimes is a lot more help than a professional so feel free to ask any questions also about streaming and if you guys want to see more twitch related like actual streaming related videos then let me know as well i hope you guys enjoyed this video i will be back with more content soon and then i'll see you guys in the next video Bye guys!